Guys, Digi here. Listen, I'm gonna show you how to change your 13.5 terahash amp minor S9 units to approximately 14.3, 14.5. Now listen, I cannot be held accountable or responsible if you break your unit, so it's not my fault. But I'm gonna show you how to do it. Let's get into it. All right, who wants to overclock their amp minor S9 13.5 terahash to an easy 14, if not 15, and I'm still pushing for 16. I'll get more settings as I divulge in deeper, but let me show you guys something. This is an older amp minor S9. I'll go ahead and refresh it. I wanna show you 14.7 is my average. 14.3 is what I'm getting currently. It's been up for six minutes. I literally just figured this trick out. So I wanted to share it with you guys so you guys can do the same. I, again, I don't take any responsibility if this hurts your machine or breaks your machine. I'm just giving you this for educational purposes only and hopefully it helps. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. So what you're gonna need to do is you're going to need to go into your Antminer GUI settings once you're into your GUI interface, you're gonna to need to enter in this URL. I will also post this in the description below. All right, so let's go ahead and go into your system, or you can actually just go to right to minor status, and then what you're gonna do is in the URL, you're gonna go ahead and change this to minor advance. I'll Go ahead and put this in the description again below. Now look what you can do. Now if you want to underclock it and keep it a little bit cooler, you can. Um, I'm still playing with the settings. It looks like the 650 gave me a pretty good result, or 675, excuse me. So let's go back to the 675. And you're gonna go ahead and click save and apply. Hit okay. And then let's see what populates on the minor status. Let's still let it populate. Now guys, again, make sure if you are overclocking your machines that you keep them cool because that's going to be a very big issue. You can run into some serious trouble if you overclock it. The heat's going to definitely increase. So again, make sure you keep them cool. But let's see once this populates. I'm going to go ahead and shut down the camera for right now. As soon as it gets back up, I'll go ahead and start recording. So I'm going to go ahead and refresh this again. I want to show you guys, look at that, 14.3, an hour and 23 minutes. We're still overclocked in the frequencies to 675 and it's still kicking. And here are the frequencies at 675.